What's up everyone, I'm Tucker Jobs and this is FM Scout and today we are doing a video of a Wonder Kid Superstar so sit back and enjoy the player that is Ernest Poku. So here we are, so uh, yeah, before we begin, don't forget to subscribe, like, leave a comment as well if you've ever had this player, and if you've got time, once more, go into the description uh, and check out my links for my channel and head over there because I also do football manager content. Alright, so here we are with a player, Ernest Poku, and as you can see, he is already pretty dangerous when it comes to speed, physicals, acceleration, and pace 17 already. He is 17 years old. He's going to improve quite a bit. Now, his um, potential rating, his max is 180. All right, I can go 150 to 180, depends on save. So hopefully you do get a big one. You do get a 175 to 180 um, version of Ernest Poku, so he becomes the best that he can be. So we've actually notched him up to 180, just so we can showcase him to the best of his abilities. Um, and we've talking to Manu, obviously a bit similar to the other videos where we've got a set tactic. Nothing special about this tactic. All right, it's just a normal bog standard tactic you can get on those pre-made ones, um, and we're gonna we're gonna play him as a striker. All right, I know he will do well as a winger. He could probably do well as an inside forward, um, but in this simulation, he will go all out striker all his career at Manchester United. So, yeah, if you want to pick him up, you can probably get him for about twelve and a half million plus a couple of add-ons. That's what we managed to get. Um, could be a little bit better. Could be a little bit harder depending on his um, potential ability as well. Um, but yeah, apart from that, let's uh, let's go for let's go a few more years first, see how he looks, um, then and then we'll go periodically between his prime to the end of his career, see what he managed to get total wise, and uh, hopefully, yeah, is <laughs> is going to be very exciting. Right then, so here we are. Ernest Poku is now 21 years old. We've had four solid seasons with him, all right, being stuck as the advanced forward for Manchester United. And as you can see with his attributes, they're getting a lot better, all right? It takes a few years, all right? We've trained him purposely as an advanced forward as well, trying to work on his physicals and trying to work on his dribbling, finishing first touch, all right? They're the most important when it comes to the striker obviously along with composure anticipation and so on but those are the three you look for in a striker um in my opinion um but yeah that's what we've been working on so yeah he's already got 19 pace right <laughs> he's he is very very fast and he's cemented himself as one of the most dangerous strikers in the world already purely because no one can catch him all right so um so far he's played 150 games for manchester united um and scored 104 goals for him all right so that's in itself insane because of how young he starts all right and um yeah he's only going to get better he isn't re he hasn't reached his top potential yet so yeah <laughs> he's gonna get a lot better guys he's gonna get a lot better currently he is worth between 107 and 122 million pounds as you can see at the top here for manchester united um operating at three and a half stars obviously potential is five so yeah apart from that is is started off really well yeah yeah really well definitely uh career stats so far you can see here First season with Manu, he got 46 goals and um, 14 assists, played predominantly as a striker. Second season in luck, 27 league goals, 43 overall. 28 league goals, 43 overall again. And the season that's just been, he only scored 32. Um, but apart from that, yeah, you can't, you can't moan. You can't moan. If you want a pacey striker, someone that could probably be trained up and play really well on the wings. Um, and this is this is the man to get and he doesn't cost that much all right 12 million plus a few add-ons is not a lot whatsoever especially if you're going to invest a little bit in some top quality youth for the future uh, or chuck him in straight away all right he is dangerous as soon as you start the game purely because of his physicals when it comes to his acceleration and pace as well so yeah not bad poku not bad at whatsoever so far he's won quite a few things already all right, he's got the uh, European Golden Boy, English Premier Division top goal scorer twice, <laughs> English Players Young Player of the Year twice, European Golden Shoe twice, World Under 21 Footballer of the Year on three occasions, NXGN Runner Up, and European Champions Cup Golden Boot Runner Up. All right, so yeah, he's, uh, he's not doing too bad at Poku, but we'll uh, go a few more years. All right, hopefully he'll reach his peak and we can have a look at him then. 
All right, so here we are. He is now 25 years old, currently worth 115 to 127 million, guys. Uh, 297 games he has played for Manchester United, 240 goals he has scored. And as you can see, his attributes did go up a little bit more. He still isn't working at his full potential. He is close, but it's not quite there yet. Physicals then. 17 acceleration hasn't changed that much but his pace has that is now 20 agility 15 balance 14 not doing too bad there considering how low they were at the start of the save anticipations flying up 17 off the ball 17 dribbling finishing first touch the three attributes we've been trying to work on most of his career and now in the greens look 16 16 and 16 so that's always nice to see technique as well is also 16 so it gets to that point in his career now where once he gets older there might be a chance his pace dropping a little bit, but his mentals are going to start increasing and getting a lot better, a lot better looking as well. Obviously, a lot more greens in there, a lot more 16s, maybe 17s, um, because he's not going to be fast all his career. So when he loses speed, he gains in other areas. Uh, so yeah, apart from that, the dude has had an insane, had an insane career. All right, so uh, here we are. Bear in mind, he's 25 years old. European Golden Boy, Premier Division top goal scorer five times, Young Player of the Year three times, European Golden Shoe four times, under 21 but, uh, Footballer of the Year four times, uh, European Champions Cup Golden Boot runner-up, World Footballer of the Year runner-up, and European Champions Cup forward of the season runner-up. So it's shocking that he hasn't won anything major yet, but <laughs> yeah, he's going to get there. He is going to get there. He is so dangerous. All right, he's fast and he can score. And at the end of the day, the career he has had so far with Manchester United. Uh, bear in mind, obviously, this was a season we got up to where he only scored 32 goals all in all. Season after that, 42, 60 all right, overall. 32 goals, 46 overall. 30 league goals here, 51 overall in the season. That's just been 47 goals. And he's chucking in with some assists as well. So even though he's only getting five or single digits when it comes to the league, um, he is chipping a few more in when it comes to cup. But he hasn't dropped below a 7 rating. And that's even when he was even young. Even when he was 17, 18, he still played really well. Which strikers normally do. Well, when it comes to players that are going to win the Ballon d'Or, the World Player of the Year, it's normally strikers, normally attacking wingers that get it. Because they're the ones that are scoring the goals, obviously, with the point system and everything. That at the end of the season when they take into account. Um, so, yeah, he's, he's definitely going to win a lot. And we're going to be able to showcase a lot. But apart from that doing well he's doing well so we're gonna probably next time take him up to about 29 29 years old see where he gets to there see what attributes have changed because being 29 surely he can't have 20 pace um and see what other ones advance because of them going down but yeah all right so we'll take him to about 29 years old see what it looks like then so then here he is at 31 years old a little bit past the 29 mark but yeah his pace did go down his pace is only 19 still but being 31 years old and having acceleration and pace 19 and 17 is incredible in itself um other attributes stayed the same dribbling finishing first touch never went up anymore uh, but his mentals do look a little bit more impressive obviously with his anticipation off the ball and vision vision went up obviously i know it's been six years all right but uh he is now pretty much playing at 180 pa now all right so he is in his prime um and he's not going to get much better he will decline but other attributes will increase with the decline of certain other attributes uh, and we'll look at him at pretty much is at the end of his career all right normally about 35 36 we'll we'll end it there all right because anything past that it's are they actually going to go past that? I know Ronaldo does, um, but other players probably won't. But uh, yeah, it's been it's been absolutely fantastic. All right, 542 games has played for Manchester United. 493 he has scored, and that in itself is one of the greatest strikers of all time. All right, not a lot of people have scored more than that. Uh, his actual accolades that is won himself. All right, his cups, his individual awards, um, quite a lot. So he's had all the under-21 footballers of the year. He's an old man now. He doesn't get any of that. Uh, so now he's got the world footballer of the year five times. <laughs> so those five years that I just said we've been, six years, is yeah, he's gone on to win the uh, world footballer of the year and the world player of the year. 
All right, so here we are. He won it first time in 2029, uh, and then after that, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. Um, yeah, pretty much the best striker in the world. Uh, and there you go, there's Sesco. All right, obviously that was another one that covered in a video on, so you can see that he becomes great. <laughs> <laughs> he's very, very good, very physical and tall. All right, he's a, he's a very good player, especially for for Arsenal. So nice one right there. So yeah, Poku is absolutely insane, guys. If we have a look at his full career, all right. So how many league got forty nine league goals, seventy in all competitions. Now, like I said, we're not using a special tactic. We're just using a bog standard preset one. All right, four two four preset. Um, but yeah, he's, he's insane and he hasn't dropped below 7. Uh, his best rating in one season was this season, the 7.87 average rating. Um, and overall, which is fantastic, 70 goals, 15 assists. What a striker. What a striker. And 31, that's probably his best attributes. We should look at his, uh, his report, his development, or our progress in all his career so all time here look you can see the kind of things that go up massively and others not so much um dribbling finishing first touch five six and five that went up in the span of 12 years and um, only because we trained on that all right you could probably train him as young enough to start molding right from the very beginning things that you might want obviously if you work on his cross and work on his dribbling he might become a very good winger especially with his pace definitely um but yeah we we focused on all that striker so that's what we wanted um long shots went up by five passing has gone up by four the older he got the better at passing he has got all right vision eight he's gone up eight 16 vision insane techniques gone up by six uh composure has gone up by five anticipation uh, you can see all his physicals right here acceleration hasn't changed it's still 17 it did it did keep going dabbling up up and down all right so it was going to 17 to 18 back to 17 um it was his pace that increased the most uh, but agility has gone up by four balance went up by five strength went up obviously because when there's a young kid they're not very strong they normally get stronger with age um jump and reach never really changed it didn't really get any taller so it's not going to change unless you work on it. It might, might go up two or three. But apart from that, we never worked on it. Um, but yeah, fantastic player. All right, leadership went up by seven. Still only 10, but it went up by seven. So yeah, it's a very good player. Um, insane. He had obviously big growth spurts, which is what you normally see in strikers. Normally like 21 years old, 24 years old. They have a, a certain time where all their attributes just fly up. Um, and it happened to him. So yeah, it's been a, been a very good player. So let's go to his end of, end of his career. All right, he's currently worth 96 million, 106 million. Let's go to the end of his career, 35, 36 years old. Obviously, he's going to be very slow. I'm guessing if he's still really fast, then something's up. But um, see what it looks like, see what he's done for his whole career, and we'll retire him at that. All right. So here we go then. Ernest Poker is now 36 years old. He has had a full, fruitful, and exploding career with manchester united and you can see his physicals have dropped they will drop acceleration absolutely flew down once he got to about 32 33 um no longer 17 is a slowish player still don't get me wrong 14 pace 10 acceleration it's not the best but it's not the slowest either for a 36 year old uh, stamina and strength did go down but other attributes in his mentals increased all right decisions composure 16 off the ball vision teamwork work rate those went up right they improved because it's getting wiser it's getting older the mental is going to get better um technicals also went down as well dribbling obviously started slowing down a little bit finishing and first touch are starting to go down now but they're still pretty good and um his whole career guys all right he scored over 600 goals over 600 goals that's more than what ronaldo did and ronaldo actually played a little bit longer all right so we could probably play force him to play another three seasons ronaldo retired at 38 39 uh and he, he might maybe get to 700 at the push i don't think he will but he, either way he's the most he's scored the most goals ever ever <laughs> are you gonna play him like we played him in the simulation um 
all his career. Probably not. He probably won't get that many goals unless you do play him every single time. But by the time he gets to 36, you've found a regen. You've probably found four different regens in different generations that are absolutely incredible. But we're just showing you that this is what he could get. All right, he is a, a very good player and had a very good career. Um, so yeah, yeah, to get 613 goals is insane. And obviously, when you look at the World Golden Ball, nine times. Nine times. All right, World Player of the Year, nine times. Uh, players Player, five times. Let's have a look how many European. Best Player in Europe, three occasions. Goal 50. All right, uh, English Premier Division Top Goal Scorer. 14 times <laughs> 14 times only twice here one obviously was another manchester united player but he was third place here and uh the later seasons he came second and in his final season the 36 years old the dude still managed to get 24 goals and um win right there but pretty much from when he started poku lot there poku po yeah so his pace is deadly, and it's allowed him to become the Premier Division top goal scorer pretty much most of his career, every single season. Day in, day out, he will bang goals in for you. <laughs> and he was very, very good. Um, so, yeah, you can't moan. All right, career stats. Look at it. Look at it. Even at 36, still scoring 34 goals in a season. It's massively dropped. But it's still doing really well. And he nearly got below 7 on the average rating. 7.13 look. And just probably one more season. He might not reach above 7. So we're going to leave it there. Alright. Um, we're not going to look at his overall progress from this point on. Because we're just going to see a lot of drops in his progress. As you can, I will show you. Just so you can see. Look. Um, all time. It's going to show them being dropped because he's getting older now. But all these going up right here. So from when he was 17 to when he is now 36, it's been nearly 20 years. And yeah, very good player. Very good indeed. So hopefully you can get him. And if you have already got him, how is he for you? Um, but you can see here for what kind of career he can have and it'll be absolutely insane for you. So hopefully it works out, guys, and hopefully this dude becomes an absolute legend for your club. Um, so, yeah, I'm Tucker Jobs. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to FM Scout. Hopefully you go over and subscribe to my channel as well, and we will see you in the future. All right, so see you later. Bye.